welcome to another vlog guys. Welcome to a totally new adventure, a new lake, deepest, darkest Cambridgeshire that I've been wanting to get a ticket for for years. I finally managed to snag one on the Woolpack fishery and there's some absolute scaly bangers in here. Load of history to this lake and one where we're going to be spending most of our time over the spring and summer. A few other places we may go to, but mostly we're going to spend it here. Many biscuits of the week are going to be told from here. And many, all the rigs, all the tackle, all the bait, all the situations, all the highs, all the lows. Join me for the vlogs that are going to appear. So guys, I'm going to push the bow around. It's all loaded up. Close the van and get cracking on this absolute superb set of lakes. Welcome to the vlog, guys. Enjoy. Okay, right, we pushed our barra around. There's the barra. Come the first swim where there's not someone in it. We're gonna have a little look. Look down there, look how beautiful this place is. Unbelievably beautiful it is. It really is proper old school. Proper old school fishing is. Look at that there, look. Give you a little first glimpse of the lake. Look at that. Look at that there, look. Beautiful, isn't it? Look at that, how nice that is. Yeah, something a little bit special there, isn't it? Beautiful lake, I think it's about eight, seven or eight acres, I suppose, something like that. Um, 60 fish in it. Apart from maybe 30s, three or four, 40s, something like that. Maybe one that goes up to 40, 50 at the right time of year. But most of them are just scaly, dark commons. I mean, the water's gin, gin clear. History, if anyone knows the history about fishing, the wall packers. Yeah, this, this lake has been around for ages. So under new ownership, um, yeah, they've done loads. They've built a new fence, built a new car park, and it's turned into somewhere where you really want to be. Well, you would want to be anyway without that, but the head of fishing here, old wrinkly old ones, old warriors, mirrors, commons, fully scouts. There's a couple of absolute to die for, fully scouts. What place? So, yeah. As the months go past, we should get more into the fish stocks. Hopefully, catch a couple. But that's a southwesterly blowing there. It's blowing up the lake. It's quite thin up that end, and it's quite more fatter or open, for want of a better word, down that end. This is sort of middle for diddle. There's a couple of guys in the swims around there. There's a couple of guys in them. So. I'd have a look at this one. I have fished in here once before. As I say, I've done, this will be my third session. And we haven't had anything, we've had blank to blank checkbook and pen so far. I've had a couple of nights on both sessions. Haven't really seen a great deal. Fished right up that end. Fished in here. This is sort of middle for diddle, so. I'm gonna go for a lap round, find out what's going on, see what we can see. See if we can see any fish, but. It's very overcast, very carpy. Don't get me wrong, very carpy. But lots of rain coming. So I'm gonna go for a quick scoot round, do a lap, see if I see anything. The sun's not out, so I don't think I'm really gonna see a lot. Although on the wind, you may see a few show. But from what they're telling me, the guys are still here, not a lot out the weekend. This is the Sunday afternoon. We've got two nights and we're gonna give it a go. New water, third trip down, searching for that first bite. So it should be a good set of videos how we progress and when we eventually catch one what we're doing and throughout the season i'm quite looking forward to 